Hello, I want to show you how to use CNN IoT. At first, download the package from the GitHub. Then, when you download the package, go inside the package and copy the main files in your ping device. To connect into the ping device, you can use the FFTP. You can use SFTP and then name of your ping and then home folder and Xilinx. Then click on connect. Then you are connected to your ping. Now you can create a folder. Let's call it test. Open the folder. And then go to the download where did you download the copy these files beta stream files and CCN and IoT I also copy the MNIST weight the MNIST data set and Alienet uh, model that we want to show you today to the P that we can use it also there is a sample of Elinet CPU and FPGA that you can copy on your pink. You go to the folder that you created before and you and you paste it here. Now you have all the files here. In the Alienet weights, you have the weights of the Alienet in NumPy format, which is the Convolve 1 BIOS weight, BIOS weight, and a fully connected layers and other. Also, we have the 3000 of the images of the MNIST dataset, which has been dis uh, normalized and ready to use. Now that you have all the files inside the pink, you need to go to the pink. When you connect to your pink, you can find your folder. Just so for running the FPGA version, you can open this Jupyter. So you here you can see that we import the CNN IoT which have we uploaded before and the second part we are loading the numpy weights for different layers convolution fully connected layer and in this data set in the second part in that part we are defining the different layers that we have in the project the convolution layers pooling layers fully connected and fully connected we have two convolution layers and we have two pooling layer but because both of the pooling layer has same characteristics we just define one pooling two fully connected layers and then here we are loading the weights that we extracted from the numpy folder, the numpy files, and we are putting them on the layers. In the next part, here we are selecting some of the images. You can decide how many images you want. Here we want decided. We decided to test on ten images, and then one by one, forward the images. You just call the layers that forward and put the image that you want to send and the DMA that uh, by default you can use the CNN IoT that DMA but if you design your hardware you can change to whatever you want and the output of this layer goes to the input of this layer and this continue we have a convolution pooling convolution pooling fully connected and fully connected finally at the end 
at the end you can use this part to calculate the accuracy so here let's run the code for you at first we load the libraries and then we load the weights we define the convolutions you can see it's run very fast and then you can see that the accuracy for 10 images uh, is 1 which means 100% and in the time of 1.75 uh, 